Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a mini Sephora haul. And the reason behind this purchase, let me tell you. The reason behind this purchase right here from Sephora is because I am starting to freelance and I am trying to invest on higher end products. And of course, I have to try them out before I actually put them in my kit. I have to be the guinea pig and see what works, what doesn't, what client I should use certain products on and things like that. So I am super excited to see how these products work. Um, a lot of these I haven't used, I'm pretty sure. Uh, maybe I've used samples or whatnot or whatever, but um, yeah, I figured I'd purchase them and see how they work. And I also wanted to let you guys know that I did film this makeup look right here. I filmed this before this one, so this is why I look pretty much the same. So I'm filming two videos in one day. And if you guys want to see how I came up with this look, and let me tell you what palette I used before I even continue. This palette right here is by Melissa Michelle. She is a YouTube beauty vlogger. And if you guys want to see my thoughts, well, hear my thoughts and see the video on this makeup look, just uh, click on the video before this one and enjoy. So without stretching this out any longer, um, let's get into the unboxing. All right, guys. So like I was saying, my cart was full. It was like a thousand dollars and honestly some things were just because I wanted them it wasn't really something that I needed or whatever it was just something that I was like oh I kind of want you know like a little kid at a toy store and yeah so I mean I was more realistic with what I actually purchased just because I need to test some of these stuff out and honestly at this second I don't even remember what I purchased so I am opening it right now let's see oh okay so I purchased the Stila nudie mood stay all day liquid lipstick set these are like mini a mini trio package and they come in Perla Patina and I'm guessing it's Bocce. I am not sure if that, I'm pronouncing that correctly, but that's what they look like. So let me swatch them real quick. Ooh, kind of thick. So this one is Bocce. Okay, so the pinky one is Patina, the middle one is Perla, and the last one is Bachi. They're really pretty. They're like really mauve colors, so I'm super excited to use those and see how they work out. I don't have a lot of liquid lipsticks, so I'm happy to have these. The next thing that I got is the Sephora Luster Matte Long Wear Lip Color. And this is in the shade Deep Plum Luster. And I figured I would get this because fall is coming. And like I said, I don't have a lot of matte liquid lipsticks. So, ooh, this is gorgeous. Look at that. That's a pretty berry color. Like, that is gorgeous. I mean, a pretty plum color. Well, berry plum. It's pretty. Wow. I'm really loving these colors. I'm definitely over summer, I'm not going to lie. I'm so excited for fall. I love fall. Fall is, like, my favorite. Oh, I love fall fashion. That's what I love. I love that. All right, the other thing that I purchased is the Cover FX Mattifying 
Prime and Set. It's this trio right here, and I figured I would try. I've tried the Cover FX Mattifying Primer, and I do like it. Um, I did want to try this. Um, what is it? This powder right here. So I'm excited to try that out. I've heard good things about this, so um, I definitely want to try this out. And it came with a mattifying setting spray, so I figured why not test all these out. Maybe I end up liking them. So the other thing in this package is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. And this one is, people rave about this so, so much that I figured why not let me add this to the cart. And that's exactly what I did. So I'm really excited to try it. Um, yeah. I mean, I'm really excited. It's, let's see what this says. This water is infused, infused, infused with electrolytes to prime by misting to create our sheerest canvas for makeup, hydrate skin for hours, revitalize complexion to boost radiance. And that's it. So I'm really excited to try this out. The next thing is I got this Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer and I got the original. I'm pretty sure this is the original. Um, I used a sample of this a very long time ago and I really, really loved it. So I figured this one for sure. I'm going to test it out again just in case, but I 100% remember loving this. So I figured I'd buy the full size. The other one I bought a travel size, this one right here. As you can see, I only bought the travel size. So. I'm testing that one out, but I figured I buy the full bottle on this one. Oh my god, you guys. I cannot wait to try this out. This is the Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Palette. Oh my god. This has been out for quite a while now and I never purchased it, obviously, and I figured I would buy it now. I did forget that it. She does all. She also came out with a brush, which oh, it's right here, which is the shade and light brush. This one right here, and I'm really upset because I should have added that to my cart, but I guess I'll get that another day because I hear that it's such a great brush. So, I mean, I have the palette. I might as well invest in the brush. So, oh my god, let me just open this up. Look at this packaging. Oh my god. I mean, I'm sure you guys have seen this. This is so pretty. Oh my god, like, I'm in love. All right, let me open it now. Because <laughs> if not, oh my god, like, I can't. Ooh, oh my god. Oh my god, so it comes with a mirror, of course, and it comes with these sh shades, and these are just absolutely, oh, I can't, like, oh my god. Wow, they are buttery, like, these are so nice. Oh my god, I cannot wait to use this. <gasps> I'm so excited about this. Like, I just, I really am. This is definitely one thing I'm crazy, crazy excited for. I'm so happy I got this. Alright, so I realized just a little while ago that I definitely went in on primers. Um, obviously, that's really important. And setting sprays. <laughs> primers and setting sprays. Alright, so the other two products that I purchased is the Urban Decay All Nighter. It's the long lasting makeup setting spray. And this is super, super important in my opinion. You want your makeup to last all day and if you are freelancing and you want the, your client's makeup to last all day with them not worrying that it's going to rub off, come off, nothing. You want it to just, just stay. like. And never go away you know so I figured I would purchase this and yeah I can't wait to try this the other primer that I bought well that was a setting spray but this one right here is another primer this is the Smashbox photo finish primer 
primerizer. It's the primer and moisturizer in one. And I figured I would freaking, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna love this. I haven't tried it at all, no samples, no nothing. But I am pretty sure I'm gonna love this because if you don't, I mean it's a primer and moisturizer in one. You're skipping, you're doing two things at once. So that's great, it saves you a step. And I mean, anything that saves me time, I'm all in for. I'm just hoping that it's going to work and do exactly what it's supposed to do. Um, it's supposed to, let's see, Insane Hydration Feather Light Texture All-in-One Power Primer. Primerizer was cr uh, created in our LA Photo doo -doo 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 Studio to replenish moisture and prep skin for makeup in one step. This non-greasy, quick-dry formula acts as a makeup magnet that locks on foundation and makes it last. Plumps and moisturizes with niacin. I don't know what that word is, but it's it's something. N i a c i n a m i d e and hyaluronic acid, and sets in seconds, so makeup goes on fast. It also claims skin feels comfortable all day. So I'm really excited to use this. I can't wait. I really hope it works the way I think it's going to. The other thing that I purchased, this is the last thing I purchased, and this I've used before. I love this. This is my favorite, favorite under eye cream. I haven't purchased this in a while. I was using a different one, and I honestly hated it because I would apply it under my on my under eye and it would actually make my eyes burn so I doubt I can return it because I was using it for a while thinking that maybe it would work and see if it would work but honestly I saw no change I felt like it not felt I saw that it just made my under eyes dry and I hated it um I don't remember the name I Honestly, I can't remember, but if I find it, I will list it down below and let you know. That's the one I disliked so much, and I'm never repurchasing that one again. But I'm going to stick with my Origins Under Eye Cream. It's the Ginseng one, and I absolutely am so happy to have this back in my life. So, you know, with all that being spent, you get free things. Free samples, and then I also got a um, you know you accumulate points or whatever and you get whatever it is those perks or whatever so I ended up getting a sample another sample well a sample of the Smashbox photo finish foundation primer um, I ended up getting the Ren clean skincare keep young and beautiful instant firming beauty shot never heard of this one before I've heard of the brand but I've never tried this so I'm excited to try it it's good to take care of your skin guys because if you take care of your skin your makeup applies a lot better and your makeup just looks flawless more flawless and more natural so definitely take care of your skin it's so so important and not just for makeup purposes but just to take care of your skin because that is so important also, I ended up getting the Buxom Lip Polish in the shade, I don't even know what shade this is. Oh, in the shade Dolly. I'll swatch that one for you. Oh, it's more like a little lip topper, like a lip gloss kind of thing. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but it's that one right there. Um, it's pretty. It's not bad. It's cute. It's definitely something that I can use to top off a lipstick or something. Um, and then I got this. It's called. It's from Lancome. It's the. It's a Grand Volume Mascara. Oh, here we go. Wait, I'm confused. It's this one right here. <laughs> oh, I like. I like the applicator. Ooh, I like. Looks like it's gonna work really nice. 
I'm really happy with everything that I got. I can't wait to try everything out and see how it works and add it to my kit. So if you guys want to see any of these products in action, leave me a comment down below. If there are any video requests, leave them down below as well. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it. That's all I could afford. <laughs> I'm really, really excited to try out these products and see if they work out and maybe add being able to add them into my kit. Um, honestly, my favorite thing is the Kat Von D shade and light palette. It is so beautiful. Like that packaging is like she went in and she did amazing on that packaging. I am absolutely obsessed with it. So um, I can't wait to try that out. Um, if you guys want to see any of these products in action, leave me a comment down below. If you like seeing videos like this, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And yeah, don't forget, most importantly, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.